Hi everyone, today we're going to be looking at my old Scratch games and playing them. This is gonna be interesting, I haven't played these ones in a while. We're gonna start off with iPad 1.0. Whoa, this is a lot of loves and favorites! I, I guess it's like my first project, so people go to it and are like, Oh, Sharky Shark's first project! Ah, yeah, I'm sure if you look at it. Uh, yep. <laughs> Gotta press space. It has the time right. That's good. That's something. I'm surprised I was even able to program that. Music app. I don't want to play the music because I, I remember making this and I didn't know how to make it stop. So you have to scroll through every single song, stopping every single one once you start playing it. So we're just not gonna do that. We'll start with Doodle Drum. I was so proud of that monster art. Like, I was so proud of it. Oh, I won. That was really easy. But I don't know, that art is, it's not great. Okay, so this painting app. I didn't know that pen was like a thing you could do in Scratch. So I just made this with clones. But of course there's a clone limit, so you can only draw for like 20 seconds. See? I ran out. And you couldn't stop drawing. And it's not even centered with the mouse. It wasn't good. Oh, a piano app. I also didn't know that um, there was note sounds in the audio library, so I just went to the piano and recorded all these notes. And I didn't even record the black keys high quality app here. I love how uh, this book is just taken right off of Google Images. Shows you how to play some songs though. Oh, great. I missed it. That obviously hit the target. That hit the target, right? I have negative six arrows. I didn't know that was possible. Okay, we gotta play this quiz game. Hello, my name is Blue. Welcome to Quiz Game. I ask you questions and you answer. Okay, let's start. Okay. How many hearts does it want to present? I stole this from Finding Dory. What, what was it? Was it? I want to say three. I'm right, but I spelled the, used the wrong your. That's that's not good. Don't use the wrong your. I hope you were listening at the beginning. The beginning was like two seconds ago. What's my name? It's Blue. Good job. Where's the smallest bone in your body? I think it's your ear. Wow. Look at me. I'm so smart. Is that it? Did I only put three questions in there? It's kind of sad. Now our final app in here. Bingo. I, I like how all of them, the, the covers of the apps are taken off Google, and then bingo, I made myself. Very obviously. Three? Do I click on three? No. Oh, okay. It just automatically does it, and then you, you see if you get it right. <laughs> if you get bingo before this thing does. But the board's the same every time. Okay, I'm not playing this. All right, let's check out the second game we have here. Now this one, I remember being really proud of this Can You Escape game. Uh, I had used to have an obsession with making escape games. I also had an obsession with making iPads. I don't know why, but uh, this was the first escape game that I was able to finish and post. I, have, I made more in the future. In like 2018, I made like five other ones. Hello and welcome to Sharky Shark's Can You Escape. Here's how you play. Look in different drawers and places to get codes and keys and sometimes a door key! Get tools to do stuff, play fun mini games, and I will guide you a little bit too. Yeah, I'm sure these mini games are gonna be so fun. Have fun. Thanks. Okay. Oh, I know I, I Okay, do you look under the rug? Yes. It's a hammer. And then you smash the vase. 926. Which one is that one? And the key? It's probably in here then. Some of these boxes have bad things in them and some have good things in them, but beware, bad things can make you lose a life. I don't think there are lives in this game. I think that was something I took out, but I didn't bother taking it out of this mini game here. There's food in here, would you like to eat it? Sure. 
Okay, nothing happened. I found the key, good for me. And then I think I just get out of here from there. Left door, no. Oh, I need a door key. Okay, so I open the chest then. I remember where the key is here. Somewhere around here. Ah, there it is. And it never changes. And so you can get it before he's done explaining the instructions. Okay. Now I know that one of the doors, if you pick the wrong one, it will make you restart the whole game. And I don't really want to do that. But I can't remember which door is the right one. It's the right one. Okay, I'm, go I'm going with left because I feel like that's something I would do. Because then it's like, you wouldn't pick right because right is right. Right, left, left. That made no sense. I chose the right door, but it's the left door. That that's why it's funny. Oh, second level. Okay, we got this. Um, there's a dog there. Pretty sure I ripped this part of the game right off of uh, Can You Escape app. It was like you had to bribe a monkey for a code, but I I used a dog. I was original, okay? I wow, guys, this is this is hidden very well. Which like to look under this? The trick is to look under everything it asks you to look under, like, uh, and then, but you need a key to open it, okay. I think I found the key in the painting, right? Found some dog food in the box. Hmm, what do I use the dog food on? I'm thinking the plant. Oh, no, okay, sorry, uh, the dog. Nice, the dog will move now. Eight, five, three. Five, three. That's right. Now, now I use this on the plant. You found a door key. Okay, so I'm guessing you choose the right door for this one since the last one was left. Yes. I got it. I still remember it. Okay, this is the final level here. I didn't even bother to ask, would you like to look under this? Um, take that. And we'll use it on paint, not pant, paint. Seven, four, three, six, two. Okay, the codes are a lot longer now. Need a key for that. Seven, four, three, six, two. I got it. Rope. Use that on that lever. Found a key, and that's. I found. That's so pointless. I find the door key in the key. Okay, we're, we're going left for this door. I got it. I escaped. I won. Wow, Sharky Shark Projects. This is, it's a great logo. I probably should just go back to this. Another one I remember being extremely proud of, Restaurant Rush. I started to make a sequel and I never finished it. But uh, this game, I was, it's like the cooking games that you play. Oh wow, look at this, the home screen, it moves, changes color, it's very fancy. Play. So you drag these people to the table and then you give them the food they ask for. Water? I mean, that's not food. Who goes to a restaurant to order water? Carrots. That was level one. I think I made like four levels or something. Three. And then I think there's a bonus one in the store. Yeah. Except the thing is, I remade all the characters and everything uh, for every single level, so they look completely different in every level. Uh, I'm too focused on talking to you, and I'm not, I'm not playing the game very well. Oh no, this guy's getting sad. Strawberries and tea. Okay. Phew. Past level two. We got 60 money. Time for level three. French fries, cake. In coffee, this is kind of intense. Tea, that's not tea. Soup, that's also not soup. Oh, that's soup, okay. <laughs> Pizza, coffee, soup. That sounds kind of gross. French fries, tea, and cake. Is that it? Okay. So now we go to the store and we got two things you can buy. You can buy the bonus level or Sharky Shar cheering you on. I just want to worry, warn you, you don't want to buy this, okay? You don't want it. First of all, then you won't be able to get the bonus level. And second of all, it's so annoying. It just plays the cheering sound over and over and over again until you stop the game. Don't buy this. Okay, bonus level. 
Let's play it. Oh, okay. Um, soup. Soup. Is this the soup now? Okay. Tea. <sighs> Strawberry. Pretzel. Tea. I'm just reusing all this food. That's kind of gross. Milk. Cupcake. And coffee. Coffee. Cupcake. And milk. We got it. We beat the game. Alright. I think I played enough of these. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Bye.